Hi everyone, so swimsuit season is in full swing and that means you are going to be in the market for a new bathing suit. Luckily, I think I'm kind of a pro at this, so here are a couple of my tips that I use when I go bathing suit shopping. Try it on. I know online shopping is easy, but people, just because you're small in a t-shirt doesn't mean you're small in a bathing suit. And just because you're a small in one bathing suit doesn't mean you're small in another bathing suit. So honestly, just don't waste your time with online shopping. Go straight to the store and try on a lot of bathing suits. Fit is queen, not king, it's queen, y'all. Just because the swimsuit looks cute on someone else doesn't mean it's necessarily gonna flatter you and your body type. This swimsuit looks killer on the model, but honestly, it just makes me look boxy, so bye. Also, don't assume that a swimsuit that's larger in size or maybe has more fabric will give you more coverage. Try on a bunch of suits and find a swimsuit that fits your body type. Focus on parts of your body that you absolutely love by bright colors or patterns. Bow on the butt, highlights my booty. A cinched waist accentuates my waist. And the back shows off my toned back. See how that works out? And of course, camouflage what you don't like by going with dark or solid colors. On days when I'm feeling insecure about my stomach, which is the one thing that I have major insecurities about all the time, I wear this bathing suit. Because the two-tone color accentuates my curves, the scuba material sucks everything in, and the high neckline brings the eye upward instead of focusing on the mid area. Know your colors. Black and jewel tone will look absolutely fantastic on light skin, while pastels and really bright colors like bright yellows slay on dark skin. Learn how to create illusions. Higher cut bottoms elongate the leg. Sweetheart cut is best on smaller boobies, and one pieces can minimize a larger waist. And my final bathing suit tip, which isn't shopping related, but it really does need to be said because it's the most important. Be supportive, not judgmental when you're looking at other women in bathing suits. I don't care who you are, throwing on a bathing suit takes a lot of confidence. And even then when you have it on, you might not be feeling confident. Trust me, I go there all the time. So instead of judging or gawking at a woman who's wearing a bathing suit that you would never in a million years imagine that you would wear, how about you just be supportive and happy that this woman had the confidence to wake up this morning and throw a bathing suit on in the first place? Because like I said, no matter who you are, sometimes doing that is just the biggest challenge. All right, everyone, so I hope those tips help on your search for a new bathing suit this season. And let me know in the comments below uh, if you have any additional tips that you'd like to share with us. I actually wanted to do a bathing suit haul for you guys, but frankly, um, you guys saw about 50 or 60% of my bathing suit collection. I do have a lot of them. So I guess I don't really need to do that. All the information on the bathing suits that I wore in this video, including this one, which I wore in my uh, how to tan video, which you guys asked me about, um, are going to be in the description box below. And also, tag me in your pictures if you end up using one of my tips to buy a bathing suit. I would love to see you rocking your new swimmies. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. You can go ahead and subscribe by clicking this box right here. We're almost at the 100,000 subscriber mark and I really, really, really want to do this giveaway for you guys. So let's hurry up, spread the word, and let's reach that milestone. I'm Aisha Dang. Thank you so, so much for watching this video and um, I'll see you all later. Ta-ta!